welcome back to my channel and today I'm going to share with you my most requested video which is my Louis Vuitton handbag collections so without further ado let's start so I'm gonna start on the front and this is my Alma BB in vernie leather and it's in red color this one has a strap actually it's inside so you can use it as a crossbody or just a handbag small one so my Alma BB uh, Bernie leather and the next one is my black multicolor Alma in PM size with studs and then this one is my the same thing Alma in epi leather in red color but it's in silver hardware then we have the again Alma it is in white multicolor so they are almost the same guys with this one it's almost the same with studs but this one doesn't have a strap and last but not the least on the Alma collection I have the GM size in vernie leather in beige color and in gold hardware so those are my Alma collections, five of them. And the next one is the Damier Azur Eva Clutch. So this one, you can use it in the evening with the chain, gold chain. And crossbody as well. And we have also the Damier Ibn in a favorite MM size. The same thing, you can use it in the evening or you can use it as a crossbody. And this is the Eva Clutch in comparison. then i think we will move on to my monogram collection so first one is the kipal 45 here it's 45 written and there is a strap i normally use this as a hand carry when i travel or you can use it as well as a gym bag. This is Kipal, size 45. So the next one is the Ellipse MM size. I bought this pre-loved and never had the chance to uh, wear it yet or use it. So yeah, and it's still in very good condition when I bought it. This is in mm size. So the next one is my sack plot monogram. So I normally use this on my dress down Thursday, and um, a laptop can fit it inside as well because it's long. And yeah, it's old by the way. Uh, next one is my monogram Beverly in GM size 
So same thing with this one, never used it yet. I bought it pre-loved. The reason being is that it's pretty heavy because of the lock here. This one, the lock is pretty heavy. It's spacious inside. And yeah, I just uh, didn't have time to use it yet. So this is Beverly in GM size. Okay, and we have the Summit Drive MM size in verni leather and it's in amarante color. The next one is we have the Breya bag in MM size. And I think, oh yes, I think there is a strap as well. And again, it is in verni leather, shiny, monogram, embossed, and in gold hardware. And then we have the black verni locket bag in black color and also it's in um, gold hardware so yeah another locket bag and this is in Sohali leather in black and this is in MM size so this one is in PM size in Bernie leather and this is in Sohali or Sohali leather and uh, yeah in black so another black bag is we have the Bowling Mountain bag in Epi Leather in Silver Hardware and it's in GM size. This one is pretty heavy guys because it's almost the same like the Beverly one where they have a big uh, lux or um, this one the hardware lux this one it's pretty heavy this and this one so um, this bowling bag I don't um, normally reach out for this bag because it's pretty heavy and um, I think the last time I've used this was two years ago or more so yeah and then so we have another black bag in electric black and this is Ponouf uh, GM size in epi leather and uh, this is a satchel bag and it's the same thing this is pretty heavy look at the lock the lock alone it's quite heavy and it's pretty spacious as well look at the side and it's nice. This is a very chic, elegant bag. It's a structured bag. And yeah. In silver hardware as well. And we have the Imprinted Leather. So this is the Antea Gizia in MM size. In silver hardware. And look at the details look at that minute details in here it's well crafted and it's really really soft guys among my Louis Vuitton collections this is the bag that I really really like it's not because of the style or any but it's how uh, the crafting was made into this bag 
for a close up look at that okay then we have the Neverfull limited edition this one has a clutch inside or uh, how do you call it pochette or I don't know so this one I normally use it in the evening or as a clutch when I go out so yeah this is very handy you can just put inside your card and your keys and that's it done ready to go so um, this is a limited edition in uh, nautical chain details here in monogram canvas and another never full in limited edition the same thing there is a pouch or clutch inside okay and this is uh, in rose ballerine uh, tahitian in Demir Azure so yeah so next one is my Minilin bandolier in 30 so the same thing there is a strap and the good thing about this strap is you can adjust it this one currently you can use it as a cross crossbody okay or you can also remove this and change it into handbag because you can detach this and use only one of them and that's it use it as a shoulder bag or rather just a doctor bag this is size 30 and another speedy but this one is not bandolier this is just a normal speedy and same thing in minilin but uh, this is in lighter color and this is in darker color and this is in gold hardware and this one is yeah as well gold okay so we have a vintage pink canvas fabric handbag and this is the I'm not sure if it's Ipanema canvas covers or Ipanema so this is how it is and the good thing about this is you can make it big so you can use it as a beach bag or maybe baby bag can be quite spacious inside it's almost the same as never full yeah there's a lot as well um, we have also a pouch inside yeah so this is already vintage when I was checking online and uh, uh, this is uh, a limited edition and it's rare and you can no longer uh, find in the market you can of course definitely you can but uh, it's a it's very rare so yeah this is big use it for beach or baby bag or you can make it smaller as well like this very nice okay then 
we have the multicolor bucket bag. So I have this bucket bag, um, the leather that uh, goes in here. I don't know where it is. I think I misplaced it or I'm not sure where it is. So I just uh, took one of my Alexander McQueen scarf or same like the Twilly one and then just use it in replacement of the leather here. Yeah. So yeah, white multicolor bucket bag in PM size. And we have another multicolor. This is basically a runway piece, a runway collection, and it's called Leonore bag. Uh, I rarely use this. I only use it when um, I go out for brunch or dinner or something because it's a bit small and it's a bit difficult to keep on you know opening it this is how this and for you to take out your wallet and everything you have to unlock it like this I would have preferred if it's a clip like this rather than a lock or a buckle so yeah, but nevertheless, this is a good piece and I have this for almost 10 years now and still in pristine condition. And now I think this is a rare piece that uh, you can no longer or you cannot, uh, you can't see it regularly in, in pre-love shop or so. Yeah, runway collection. So, yeah, multicolor. I really love the multicolor one actually. And hoping to add more. I would love to have the speedy multicolor one. So, I hope I'm gonna find one soon. So, I think I have only two bags left. And uh, one of them is this Paris Sopo Whisper bag in GM size. Sorry guys if I cannot pronounce it correctly, but um, I'm gonna put in the descri description uh, the model name of the bag. So yeah, this is a limited edition as well. And it's pretty big actually. This is the GM size. Yeah. And the same thing. I love the um, Louis Vuitton uh, embossment in here and this bag has been I think m almost 10 years now and I think it needed restoration to make it darker or so but yeah but I like the color right now it's just like a vintage feel in it so here's the tassel and yeah, whisper bag in GM size. And, and the, last the last one, one is my limited edition halo bag. So this is in, you know, shimmering silver bag with tassel as well. It's almost the same as this whisper bag with tassel. yeah so this is impriente as well impriente leather pretty soft and this is just cute little bag a limited edition one halo bag so guys those are my louis vuitton handbag collections if you have any questions please do let me know and if you want me to review or compare please do let me know and if you are new to my channel and you love fashion and bargain shopping please consider subscribing and don't forget to hit that notification bell in order to be notified when I upload new videos and if you are a returning subscriber thank you so much guys 
and i'll see you again on my next video bye